Hey guys, Matt Allen, Tim Little. Welcome back to Tactical Bassin. We're doing things a little bit differently today. We've got this area that every fall we do really well in, but the water's dropping. And every fall when that bite gets good, we can't get the boats in there anymore. So this year we stepped up, just got a pair of kayaks so we can get back into this place after the boats can't get in there see if we can stick some of these big fish. This is literally our first attempt at it. <laughs> Going out in these kayaks for the very first time, thought we'd take you along with us. We'll see if we can catch some fish. Maybe we can catch a big one. But we're gonna go out, get used to the boats, and have some fun. Let's do it. First drop on the first flip. You know what's really nice about this particular kayak, played around with a few of them, with this pedal drive, it's got a prop down there, and you can actually pedal to go forward, and when you hook a fish, you can pedal, pedal in reverse and hold yourself there. Uh, pretty cool contraption. So before we lose too much light, I'll tell you a little bit about the boats that we settled on. We both went with the Old Town Predator PDL. Uh, it's a large platform. Tim and I are both big guys. Uh, north of 200 pounds, pretty tall. So stability was really important to both of us. We wanted a stable platform that, that we could stand up on, you know, have no issue. You're not gonna fall out of it. You know, been in this boat for like 45 minutes and 
totally comfortable side to side. Already set the hook standing up. The kayak in general gives us great access to areas like this. See, in, in our bodies of water, we get a pretty serious drawdown in the fall, and it leaves these backwaters that we no longer have access to, but the fish are still there. It's haunted us for years, because we're smashing them, and then next day you bump bottom a little, next day you hit hard, third day you get stuck, and you're, those fish are gone. Well, now they're not gone. We're in the kayak, we're up here, we're catching fish really excited about it now this particular boat the predator pdl i told you it's a big platform what i really like about it personally i'm coming from the bass boat side of things so it's pedal driven and this is up right now because i'm in such shallow water but you pull it out drop it down and then it'll lock in here now it's pedal drive instead of having to run a paddle while you're trying to fish what I like about this pedal is that it's prop driven. Coming from the bass boat side of things, it's just logical. It's just an easy transition. I'm used to running a trolling motor every day. I understand exactly how a prop is gonna work. I have forward and reverse in here, which is really nice. Rudder, of course, and then of course you still have a paddle strapped to the side just in case, but really nice boats. Obviously we only have like a half hour, hour into them so far, but really happy with it thus far gonna put in a bunch of time let's keep fishing guy ate it like he was big. That makes the official outtake reel. That was sad. All right guys, so hopefully you guys enjoyed that. You know, kayak fishing, you know, there's so many pros to, to getting out on a kayak. You're quieter, you get access to uh, bodies of water and areas on the water that you can't access with a big boat. You know, a lot of us, we, we run around those big 20 foot boats with the, the big motors and we zip around to the next spot. When you're, when you're quiet and you're, you're slow and methodical, you can actually really tune your techniques and become a better fisherman. You know, Matt, 
we we probably did the two hardest techniques to start off on a kayak you know punching and frogging you know uh, we're not the bo most uh, agile uh, you know me a little bit more than him but um, you know it's a lot of fun and uh, we got back here we caught some fish and uh, we're really looking to get into this you know these are these are awesome boats you know Matt and I we did our research and we figured out what we wanted uh, but we're gonna need your help in accessories you know there's so many accessories and things that we may need um, so down below in the comment section if you guys are a, a kayaker let us know what you think we need and we'll look into it but uh, if you guys like that video hit that like button subscribe to the channel if you guys want to see more kayak fishing videos give us a thumbs up we appreciate you guys have a good one Thank you.